Congratulations, Cub. Another knockout. Now you're 2 and 0. They don't call you savage for nothing. Don and I ran up there cuz we wanted to see right in the front. So, how you feel about this? I feel, I feel great. Uh, and I'm ready for the next one. I told Mel right away if that roster is not filled up for December, put me on the card. I don't care if it's 70, 80, 85. I'm ready. Uh, thank you for coming for doing this. You look good. You look great. So, thank you. <laughs> you know, we're all and that's why we talk about why we do this. It's like I've done it. You know, and I I understand what you guys go through. I support you guys. We're here to give you guys a platform and and grow this for everyone. Mel loves you. You're clearly a fan favorite. You're a throwback. I dig everything about you. The mustache, all of it. And obviously the fans love you and you come to win. So you want to get the belt. Who do you want to fight next? Name name someone. Honestly, I'll fight anyone to get me to Jose Fernandez if it's not Jose Fernandez right now. Uh he, he has some surgery, I put him out, so whenever he is cleared up, I don't even care if I have to jump to 80, 80 to get that belt and then come down and strip that one from him, I'm going to do it. I want to become a BYB's first three belt holder, that's my goal, and uh, no one's going to stop me, so that's what I'm doing. And when you talk, especially at the fighter meetings, I believe you. There's some people that talk, and I, I know, but every word that comes out of your mouth, and Mel's just... He's like, that's my boy. That's my boy. We love you. Congratulations. And um, go enjoy your win. Bye.